Morning guys, I just left the gym. Not gonna lie, it was the first time I've gone all week. Or maybe I should say I didn't go last week and I just started off this week and it was amazing. I did an hour on the incline treadmill, burned over 400 calories, did over three miles. Like, it just felt good. It is sunny today, I am full of energy. I mean, that time change just got me all the way together. Like, I don't understand how 60 more minutes of rest could do that, but I feel like a completely brand new person. For meal prep this week, I want like a meatloaf casserole. Is that a thing? Like, I want all the makings of meatloaf without the actual loaf. So I don't really know how I'm gonna accomplish that. I also know that I want some sort of cauliflower dish. Is that mashed cauliflower? Is that cauliflower mac? I don't know yet. So I'm just gonna buy some stuff. For my second meal, I am thinking salmon perhaps. I've been seeing salmon on Insta lately and it looks really good and I like salmon. And I was like, wait a minute, it's very easy to cook and it's very flavorful by itself. So that's what I'm gonna be having for my second meal. I mean, basically, I'm just gonna go to the store and buy a bunch of stuff and then see how I feel like preparing it. So, let go. Okay guys, I am done with meal prep and I'm very excited about it. I can't wait to show you. I am heading to the shop and I officially retract everything I said this morning about the time change because it's not even five o'clock and it is getting dark. It is gloomy, my headlights are on and I'm sad. So, I know it's a trade off, but like, come on winter. Ugh. Okay, well I'm off to do some errands and then I'll be back. Okay guys, I am back from the shop and it's only 6.30 and it feels like a million o'clock at night. Like it feels like midnight. So I'm done for the day. I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna have a lot of hours of TV watching and I'm happy about that. But let's look at what I have this week. So first I have this deconstructed meatloaf. Basically all it is is ground beef with some onions and jalapenos, of course. I threw in some garlic powder, onion powder, salt and pepper, and then I just dumped in some low sugar ketchup, sugar-free barbecue sauce, and 
mustard only because I had some extra mustard that was just like just enough to be used for one thing and it's really good like I don't know if it's like a cheeseburger casserole-ish or something but either way it tastes really good so my thought process is that I'm going to heat this up I know it's the easy way out but these were on clearance and I was like I cannot pass this up so I'm gonna top my meatloaf with the mashed cauliflower make like a shepherd's pie sort of thing so I'm excited to see how that turns out and then speaking of excited look at this salmon Kristen this is for you um, this looks great I'm gonna have salmon and broccoli and I'll probably throw some butter on this this is once again just microwave frozen broccoli that I'm gonna put in the microwave and then I'm going to eat with my salmon and it's gonna be delicious snacks we got the Atkins bar we got Zevia jello and then I also bought these these like little ice knockoffs <laughs> they're the Meyer version of the ice drinks I'm just gonna try something else for a little bit of caffeination I also have the Powerade Zeros in the refrigerator be sure to watch my what I eat Wednesday video for this week to see how I put this all together because to be honest I don't even know how it's gonna turn out so I'm really excited thanks for watching if you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel watch autumn keto I make weekly meal preps weekly what I eat Wednesdays and monthly weigh-ins Go ahead and comment down below your favorite fish dish. Ooh, say that three times fast. Uh, I am excited about this salmon and I kind of want to get some other fish ideas. So go ahead and let me know what your favorites are. You can also catch me on Instagram at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll catch you next week.